Hello guys and welcome you again to this week's edition of 4 Minutes Wisdom with Obin Wachazuka. Now if you are new to our channel, do well to like this video and subscribe. Click the subscribe button below and click on the bell icon so you'll be notified whenever we come, out, come up with educational videos just like this every week. Now this week I'll be speaking on the title, The Tale of Two Buildings. Now the first building is, uh, uh, is the tallest building in the world. It's, uh, it's called the Burj khalifa in dubai its height is about 2722 feet it has about 160 floors and 2909 stairs it takes about 96.96 hours that's about four days to climb this structure without an elevator that's amazing now it's more amazing to know that below this 160 floors is also a 164 feet foundation wow I don't know how they did the math, but I assume that for every extra floor they added above the earth, they added one feet depth beneath the ground. Now, you too are also interested to know that this amazing building took six years of consistency and hard work to pull through. Now, I know another building, which is the second building, whose construction started many years ago. It was pegged at the seventh story and it was roofed. Now, just before the painting and the finishing began, it was discovered that the foundation of this building was not deep enough to carry this massive structure. So it was advised that the structure be abandoned immediately and it has been abandoned for almost half a century now. Now the abandoned structure has since become a major landmark around where I stay. It's called Seven Deck. Now the Burj Khalifa and Seven Deck are two very famous buildings now one of them is still very useful and quite expensive while the other is abandoned now what's the difference foundations now there's this trap I, I i used to be caught in and i see many people still caught in that trap today it's called the see my mate syndrome see my mates see what my mates are doing see the kind of car they are driving see the kind of clothes they are putting on now the bad side of this syndrome is that it doesn't let you see the foundation on which your supposed mate is standing. The hard work, the tears, the diligence, the sacrifice, the sleepless nights. Come on guys. The higher you must go, the deeper your foundations must be. So stop envying the success stories of people without asking for the number of stories. S-T-O-R-E-Y's buried below the ground to give them the success story s-t-o-r-y now that syndrome will only lead you down the path of unsatisfaction and utter unfulfillment because no matter the kind of success the height you attain in life there seems to always be that one guy that one girl that one man that one woman that always seems to be ahead a, a, a step ahead of you so you always if you're caught in that see my mate syndrome you always have that desire to buy just that one more new car, that one more new watch, that one more new whatever it is you want to buy, whatever it is you've seen your mates buy. And the truth is that you just remain unsatisfied. It becomes an addiction for you and you end up getting nowhere. Now, the truth is nobody is actually your mate in life until you've led the kind of foundation they've led and actually had the kind of structure that they've built beneath the ground to hold up their success stories. Now, the richest man in Africa says, I fear that the problem of the youth of today is that they want to get where we are today, but they are not willing to give time to their businesses and start where we actually started. Guys, you don't get success, you build success. You don't get wealth, you build wealth. It will take time, but if but you must give it that time in sufficient quantity if it must stand the test of quality and sustainability now i usually say this that the last ingredient of success the last the last ingredient on the recipe of success is time but so many forget to add it in sufficient quantity so guys take your time add that last recipe called time to whatever it is you're doing give yourself time Allow your foundation to deepen beneath the earth so that your success will stand tall and stand the test of time. So guys, see you again next week. And I hope this blesses you. And I hope you didn't forget to like our video and subscribe. So do that now if you didn't do it in the beginning. Alright guys, see you again same time next week. Alright.